Alrighty, here's going to be a blue star formula that I'm making. I've actually used this in a, um, a six inch shell that I built and they were pumped stars and they were very vibrant and very pretty blue. Here's the chemical, uh, the chemicals that I'm going to use in the formula. So this is going to be for a 500 gram batch and it's going to end up being 525 grams with the 5% dextrin that I'm going to be adding. And I already have my scale zeroed and all my chemicals ready. So there's 67 grams of the copper 2 oxide. Here's the 10.7 grams, or I mean, I'm sorry, 53.5 grams of the Parlon or chlorinated rubber. 330 grams for the potassium perchlorate. 25 grams for the dextrin and 49 grams for the red gum. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start adding them together. I'm going to start off with a little bit of the potassium perchlorate here. Add some of the parlon just to kind of kind of mix it before it'll, it'll save me a little bit of mixing in the process. screen it. Screen it a few times. Make sure it's nice and homogenous. Dextrin likes to get a little cakey. pour it into this container here. And I'll put it through a screen again. Now that it's a little bit mixed, I'm actually going to put it through a little finer screen. You want to mix it as many times as you can through a screen and make sure it gets nice, nice and mixed together, nice and homogenous. And then when I bind it, when I make my stars, depending on which stars I'm going to be making, if I'm pumping the stars, I just add just a little bit of water just to moisten them up. Um, if I'm rolling them, I usually actually hand roll them because I don't have a actual star roller and I use a um, a mixture of acetone and water and just put the lid on this and kind of shake it up a little bit. Put it through the 
the screen again. back in here. I do plan on making pump stars with this. The last shell I made was a six inch red and white um, shell. I've got an eight inch I'm going to be making. Red, white with a blue strobe ring. And that's what these are going to be for after I get these pumped up and ready. And I'll have another video here coming up after this of the red stars, that, the formula that I'm using and how I'm going to make them. That's pretty well mixed. So, I will take this outside here in a second and just light a little bit of the powder on the ground so you can see the nice vibrant blue. And after I get some stars made up, I'll I'll do some uh, star tests out of a star gun. There's the the formula again for those who may be interested. And I will be right back. All right, now it's a little bit dark out here, so it might be kind of hard to see. I'm gonna pour some of this comp out here that we just just mixed up. See how that blue looks. It's pretty darn bright. Definitely looks a lot better when it's pumped and pressed. But hope you guys enjoy the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will have more videos and formulas and stuff coming along the way. Thank you. star that I had already pumped and primed. This is the same formula. So this will, this will kind of be what it looks like. Nice and pretty. Very, very, very vibrant in the sky.